I'm Brian Westbrook with GeekWire Studios here at the Nebius booth chatting with Mona Lee, the global head of startup ecosystems. First of all, what an incredible job. Tell us about your role in the ecosystem. Here's Silicon Valley, you are entrenched with startups. Tell us about that. Yeah, actually, so this is an amazing role. I'm so fortunate to be part of this because I've been spending over a decade you know, in the startup and this ecosystem. So as you know, like the AI is booming, especially for a generative AI. So we are seeing, especially for starting from this year, we're seeing that um, the AI startups are shifting from the general purpose AI solutions to a more tailored, like a specialized um, solution for specific verticals such mm -hmm. as healthcare, robotics, and finance. And also like following the deep seeks success that we are seeing like, oh, it actually opens the door to a broader range of the startups and uh, you know, business can doing their own application with more cost effect uh, models, open source models, and to leveraging all those like high performance models to build up their applications. And also at the same time, we're also seeing that because of the broader adoption of the AI technologies, so the startups are really looking forward to seeing like, oh, what are some of the solutions can provide me to access to a more cost effective, high performing you know, platform to help me supercharge my startup, to help me really to tap into the real, to tackle the real life solutions, right? So those are some of the trending that we are seeing that is really happening in the Silicon Valley. One of the things that we've heard from a lot of different startups here at NVIDIA GTC is that Nebius has an amazing program for startups. What are some of the key benefits and how can startups get involved and unlock that potential? Yeah, so we actually do have um, a new startup focus program. So we call it Nebius for Startup. So um, for we have like several key um, benefits. So first of all is that we offer up to 150K cloud credits to startups to help them to hit the ground running. And secondly is once they join our platform, they will uh, get the priority access to the most cutting edge GPUs provided by the NVIDIA as we are the premium partner of NVIDIA, as well as that they will get um, a, a, uh, like evergreen startup focused um, um, content template playbooks that we designed for each of the use cases and verticals. And most importantly that we're building up a AI focused, a startup focused community that we're bringing together all the AI experts, researchers, developers, um, partners, investors, and to, to our ecosystem that we can help them to connect, connect the dots and then really help them to supercharge their go-to market, to help them uh, form more like a strategic alignment uh, alliance with the other partners and also looking for potential funding opportunity for our investor network. Yeah. Now, community is very important, especially as a startup, kind of going at it alone is very difficult. You're hearing from these startups in this community that you're helping build about their pain points. What are you hearing and how are you helping them solve those pain points? Yeah, I think that's a great question. So. One of the biggest challenges that we're seeing from the startup is to really access to a scalable, high-performing, for example, like high-performance high computing um, platform um, with a very affordable price, right? Um, for example, like the traditional cloud service providers, they weren't built with the AI native approach. They were more optimized for the general cloud um, workloads not for the massive computing power for model training or inferencing. So Nebius was founded to address this gap by bringing together uh, to building a full scale, um, a full stack, a scalable infrastructure that um, to provide the startup with the power, scalability, flexibility, and all the infrastructure resources they need to scale. So that is why our startup program is an extension of that vision to really ensuring the early stage founders can access to the best tools and the resources and the ecosystem um, components to help them to grow and scale with the, the resources they need. Now, Mona, I, I'm sorry, just listening to you talk about this is absolutely inspiring. There's a lot of really great things that you're sharing. If I'm a startup co-founder, how am I getting involved? What should I do to join the Nebia startup program? Okay, so I think the simplest way is to send me an application on our website. Um, but we also host many of the community events. 
You can see us in many of the local events, online webinars. You can feel free to join us, learn more about our offerings, learn all about like our platform, our startup program, and talk to us and speak about your use cases. We'll find a way to work with you to get you into our program or introduce you to the right team, right person, and to start with the collaborations. And I have to ask, we think of startups a lot of times outside of Silicon Valley. We think, oh, that's a Silicon Valley thing. What would you say to startups that are maybe not based here in Silicon Valley that are maybe around the globe? What programs do you have for them? Oh, our startup program is actually aimed for the global assets. You know, everybody, uh, if you're bootstrapped or if you're already raised some of the fund up to pre CSP, please welcome to apply our startup program. We have all the resources available and we recognize that startups in different stages actually need different resources and support. So we are here to build up our exclusive uh, and dedicated support and resources to help them to supercharge their growth in different stage. Um, so yeah, um, you know, please um, welcome to join our startup program by submitting the application. We're here at NVIDIA 2025 GTC. I'm excited to hear what's on the horizon. What are you looking forward to when you and I get together next year? Um, so to be honest with you right now, let's talk about like this year is pretty much like the, the year of AI agent. Yeah. So you know that all the startups and everybody is building up their agent, right? We call it agentic AI. Yeah. And especially people are really narrowing down their approach to really tap into the real life challenges to solve the real life problems. So I think starting from this year, going to the next year, we will see more like AI agent adoptions across the globe. We'll see more startups getting mature yep. and really have their agent to work for humans, right? To really help us to increase our productivity, to increase the efficiency and everything around us, right? It will be amazing for us. That is fantastic. Yeah. And thank you, Mona Lee. There's a lot of great things you're doing, not only for the startups here in Silicon Valley, but the global startup community. Thank you so much for joining us. That is Mona Lee, global head of startup ecosystem. I'm Brian Westbrook, GeekWire Studios. Thanks for watching.